I came up here to get my boyfriend. Okay. Apparently, he said he had to go to his car. I don't know if he knew she was out here or not. I don't know what's going on. Okay. Literally, she wanted people out of the apartments to see who you were yeah, with. On December 19th, 2021, the local fire department responded to an apartment complex in reference to a fire alarm being pulled. Shortly after their arrival, they requested police be en route due to an altercation between two women where the alarm was located. The firefighters tried to explain the situation the best they could, but the police had no idea the drama they were about to walk into. Hey, what's going on? What's going on, big dog? So, a fire come out here for a fire alarm. We're now it's a domestic. So, what's going on? Hey, you mind just going by back of my car for me? You know, I ain't saying nothing. You were going to court final on the phone. You said y'all were sitting in the Teddy. We talked to her. Hey, ma'am. I live here. Okay. I ain't even. I ain't, so, what's I, going on this morning? Okay. It's. I don't even know what time it is right now. Okay. Me, so, what happened this morning? He was there. He was running yesterday. And instead of him being at home breathing, he came up here. All I asked him when I came here was who he was here. Okay. I mean, we could have been left. So, are y'all together? Yes, we're together. Okay. You want to hop out and talk to me somewhere else? Yeah. That'd be better? Okay. Uh, all right, we'll talk to you out there, man. Hey, ma'am, if you want to, just chill in the vehicle for a second. There's only two of us out here. It's easier to separate people and talk, all right? We'll just walk over to this car, all right? Huh? All right, so we got limited information right now, okay? Yeah, yeah, we're good. Sorry, I just... No, that's fine. Like I said, that's what it all stemmed down from. Uh -huh. All I've got is one side. So okay. Far. Ain't nobody told me nothing. I don't know why they got into it. They got to fighting over there. Uh-huh. Her phone and her keys got thrown. The second lady... Run upstairs, pulled the fire alarm. That's her. That's she pulled the alarm, right? No, the one in this oh, okay, car. This pulled car. Okay. Alarm. Okay. And that's why we ended up over. Yeah, absolutely. The alarm's mm -hmm. reset, so there's no hazard okay. there. Wasn't ever any hazard All there. Right. She but just I yanked it for whatever reason. Yeah, they were fighting at one point, and then at one point they were both back outside. Mm -hmm. One of them was holding a pair of scissors, and we got talking about she better not get out of the car, so I didn't okay. want to have to deal with all. Hey man, just stay over here for a second, all right? Yeah. Okay, yeah, y'all good to go then. Yeah, yeah, I appreciate. it. Thank you. Anyway. Yeah, talk talk to me if you don't mind here. Let's well, figure out what's going on here. Did he girlfriend? First of all, he just lost his brother yesterday. Well, he what now? Yesterday, the funeral. Funeral? Yeah. I don't know anything about what you mean by funeral and whatever. So, first of all, I guess who are we referring to? A male? Mm -mm, this male did. right there in that black. Yeah, I did. Then, though, that's the thing. No, it was the girlfriend. Yeah. Okay. So, so what? So what's going on then with man, with them? It's with you? In the morning. With... It's seven o'clock in the morning. I'm just like, okay, my fire alarm, alarm, they going off. I know my alarm don't never go off, first of all. Mm -hmm. both, both me and him just got back last night because his brother died last week. But the funeral was yesterday. Okay. When you say you and him. Me and him. Him? I don't know where the hell she come from. I'm not trying to cuss. Th this guy yes. right here. He's straight. He, the man ain't did nothing. Okay. He don't need to go to jail, period. He ain't no, I'm just anything. trying to figure out when you say him and, yeah, he, he and we did. got back. So does he live here with you? No, but. When you say we got back last night, then oh, did he, he come came, here? Yeah, he came. Did to he my spend house. the night here yes. last night? Okay. Yes. What, are you guys just friends? Or were you guys, in, yeah. are you... All right, see how this is going, right? We got information about, like... Oh, I'm going to tell you. Okay, yeah, 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 let me get it, all right? All right. So what happened? We, me and him talk or whatever. Okay. So I'm like, why am I fighting on the only one that's going off? So I come outside. I see her outside trying to fight him or whatever the situation is. So I walk, so I walk literally on these, on the concrete. Mm -hmm. The girl hit me in my face. Okay. Mind you, I'm not going to lie to you. I've been wanting to fight this girl since high school. I let the shit go yesterday at the funeral. I let the shit go. Stay in the car for me. No, no, no. Bro, stay in the car. So, uh, okay, so go to the female. They, they've been having issues with each other. Okay, are they both your girls? Uh, I mean, you. you okay. But, uh, hang on, just hang on. Hey, stay in the car for me. I'm not going to tell you that again. Just stay in the vehicle. Okay. Stay in the vehicle. Stay in the vehicle. We got to figure this out. Anyway, like I was saying, you know, um, they been having some issues for some time. So, uh, that pretty little lady in the car, mm -hmm. um, um, she been doing some things, you feel me? Okay. So, you know, um, so, you know, I've, I've been trying to let it slide, but it just like events that just kept happening. So, you know, I came, I, I, my brother died probably like two weeks ago. Okay, I'm sorry to hear that. Uh, it's, it's okay. And then she been trying to be here for me too, mm -hmm. so, you know. With everything that she had going on with somebody else, I just I just came up, you know, so you okay. know, 
I'm getting a phone call in the middle of the morning, at like 7 o'clock, we in here, we in here sleep. Mm -hmm. So, you know, I'm saying, I can see if her calling me. So, you know, I'm just like, man, I'm just finna go home because I was already getting a bag. This is the house of the girl yeah, with the dreads, yeah, the yeah, long hair? Yeah. Apartment, okay. Yeah, apartment. Okay. So keep, so keep telling me then. So the alarm went off, so you came outside. Yes. Were both of you inside when the alarm went off? Yes. Okay. Apparently, he said he had to go to his car. I don't know if he knew she was out here or not. I don't know what going on. Okay. But the alarm was just going off. I stepped literally right there. The girl hit me. I fell on the ground. I had got up. I was on top of her. That's when he had pulled me off of her. Mm -hmm. So that time, I know I'm losing my phone and my key gone. The whole put my phone beside my car. Okay, we'll, we'll look for your keys. Don't worry. We'll, find, we'll figure all that out. Y'all better find them before I find them. Like I told them, I find my keys. I'm going in my car and get... So, uh... So, uh... I was getting a phone call, I'm just like, you know, let me get going on, on the going on downstairs or whatever. So, boom, um, I'm coming out her house, and I get all the way to the bottom of the stairs, and she's sitting at the bottom of the stairs waiting on me, so it's just okay. like, I... Like, Basically track you down is what you're saying. Yeah, uh -huh. so, so I'm just like, you know, how you, how you get down here, so I, I'm stepping outside, I'm saying, before, before any of this happened, bro, we could have been gone. Okay. The only thing I kept telling her, they just go, but I kept trying to get in my mm -hmm. car. Every time I was trying to get in my car. So, before, I, I think before, before we got down the stairs, she pulled up. No, she had came up the stairs a little bit because she was trying okay. to figure out where I was. And then, uh, then when she had ended up pulling the fire. Hey, Marty, you talk to the female in the Nissan right here? Uh, you talk to the female in the Nissan? The female? Yeah, front right passenger. Hey, good morning. Hey. How you doing today? Good morning. What's going on today? I came up here to get my boyfriend. We just buried his brother yesterday, so I'm looking at his location. Cause, cause I'm we had, we got into like a heated a heated argument. We didn't break up yesterday, so I, I just came up here to him like, why are you here? Who are you here with? So I came here and I called him a bunch of times, no answer. Went up went upstairs. I didn't know where she stayed at, but I'm asking him who lives here, who lives here. And we coming all the way down the stairs. That's all I asked him. We didn't talk about nothing else but other than who lives here. Like, like seriously, the fire alarm going off and the girl that came out here. So I know who it is now. So I'm, I'm trying to figure out why is he here with her? Mm -hmm. like, like why? That, that's why I'm so, I'm just so mad. And she, she acting like I just went out and attacked her. Like I just took her keys. Off to, like if it, 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 it's a lot of y'all out here. All y'all gotta do is just go over there and look. Because if she came, I told them, if she came out here with keys, you would have heard them coming down. I didn't see nothing in her hand but scissors in the phone. That's it. But and what in a phone? Scissors in the phone. So who had scissors in a phone? She did. And get my pepper spray. Is this your car right yes. now? Yes. And let me tell you why I don't get my pepper spray. And I don't care if y'all know. This girl, we've been having these conflict going on since high school. I am 21 now. You're probably 19 or 20. You come to somebody else's property. I don't live here by myself. So y'all better find my key before I find my key. Cause don't come to my house messing with me. Okay. That's all I'm gonna say. Okay, hold on, hold on, come here, come here, come here. Let me, let me finish. Wait, they, wait. They on the ground. I'm not worried about that. Okay. She, she didn't, you know what, I'm not worried about it. But um, we're, we're still here because I told you, you know, we can leave. I thought if I thought who stay here, we can leave. But he's still saying, trying to figure out where her keys are when I, when I don't have them. Like, all you have to do is look up, because we didn't come all the way up here. All you got to do is look where she's throwing me, either on her way down here, over there in the bushes, or either right here. We didn't go too far, we stayed right there. Okay. Do you have an ID? I don't have my stuff with me. Okay. All right, so she pulled the alarm, going uh, back and forth. Do you know why she pulled the alarm? Because she was trying to see who I, was. I went to. Literally, she wanted people out of the apartments to see who you were yeah, with. It, I, sorry, I went to tell her, okay, it wasn't important. It, it wasn't I wonder if I feel like I want to tell you, I would, I would have told you. Mm -hmm. I would have probably eventually told all the way down the road. Okay. But the fact that you, you sit here doing all that and, and, and people stay here. You yeah, feel me? No, absolutely. Like, like, they, like, this is not no, I would have to go to college. I want to tell her, this is not no, like, no college dorm or no, even though you probably have college students mm -hmm. staying here, but I was like, this is an apartment, bro. Like, yeah. Like, multiple people stay here, not just one person. Mm -hmm. So, you know, and then, um, both, um, so when uh, everybody finally came, well, she went out, she went outside yet. Okay. But she eventually came out, and uh, she sent her, the girl was recording, trying to see what was going on. And then that thing, you know, she just walked up to her saying something. I was just, mm -hmm. I, I ain't, I ain't know what, what she had said. Okay. And that thing, you know, they just got in fight. Yeah. What did you see with the fight? Oh, so who got in a fight? You and her, or all three of y'all, or what? 
Yeah, me and her, and then he tried to break it up. Fight, because all she did pull my hair. We just pulled half because I was trying to get out. Okay. So, the girl in the car hit the other girl. How'd she hit her? Like, slapped her, knocked the hell out of her with her fist. She grabbed her hair. Like, like how'd she hit her? Oh, I really couldn't tell you how to hit her. Okay. Well, well, you I, saw I, I commotion happen, yeah, basically. Yeah, okay. Yeah. And did you see anything else past that? Uh, no, they, they basically just, they weren't really fighting. Okay. Really rolling on the ground, just right. wrestling and mm -hmm. shit like that. But, but I just What's, told him, like, I didn't even see her try to try to argue with her this damn third. After that, we walked away. I told him we could come on and leave. The only reason we're still here is because he was trying to help her find her keys and stuff. Uh huh. And I told her like, all you gotta do is look over there. We didn't we didn't argue no further or nothing. Then okay. Then, so what do you think needs to happen today? I mean, does anybody then, need to go to jail or? No, I ain't even gonna say she need to go because if maybe if I if I was stabbed or something, then yeah. But I just really want this this shit to be left. I, like I, I, I really want her to find her keys because that's the only reason we out here. I just want her to find her keys. Okay. The only reason I didn't go help her find her keys is because she said, well, she found her keys, she going to help for me. So I'm like, okay, maybe I just want to find her keys. Like, these are, these are his keys. Where are my car keys? These are my keys. I don't have help for anything. That's the only reason why I want help her because she I know she got it on there. If she came out here with it. Then she, if she had regular keys, I would have to find it so me and him can go home. That's all I've been telling her. I want to go home. Okay. What's and your last, like, what's your last name? Huh? Why? Why? Because yeah, I'm, I'm here conducting an investigation and trying to sort out what's going on. And as a matter of policy, we identify folks that that, that we're dealing with when we come onto a scene. But who, who called you? I'm just saying, like, a whole. Well, the fire department called us because somebody pulled a fire alarm and they got here and they checked it out and then they found out, well, there's a, a big, you know, fight, brouhaha. Whatever you want to call, so they called us, wanted to make sure everything is all sorted out. So that's why we're here. She didn't call, you didn't call, he didn't call, the fire department we called. Could've, we could have been here. Well, why is he over there? Because like, he was not, talking to the other officer. So are we not, are we not leaving? That's all I want. I just want to go home. Okay. Yeah, that, like, well, the sooner you give me a name and date of birth, sort this all out and get you on your way. Huh? What's your first name, Miss Buck? Did you ever see any weapons or anything? Uh, uh, uh. No, okay. But so who had scissors and a phone? She did. No scissors, no knives, no guns. Okay. All right. So basically, you were here with uh, purple. purple. You were here with Purple. Girl in a Nissan found out why you were here somehow. Came over here, wanted to see where you were at, pulled the fire alarm, said, here he is, and got into it with the other girl, right? Okay. You mind if I get your information, man? Oh, yeah, I'm fine. One hell of a way to wake up, right? Man. What's your first name? Oh, Cartridges. Birthday? 2000. And phone number. All right, if you don't mind, just chill over here. Obviously, right. you're just kind of stuck in the middle of this right now, all right? Yeah, it's Is right. the Nissan on your vehicle? Yeah, man. Okay. All right, we're going to try to get you out of here as soon as we can. Obviously, you didn't get harmed, nothing yeah, like that I'm, in this, right? Oh, I'm pretty bit late in the car. So I'm going over here. Okay. Please, whatever. No, I'll I'll, you. I'll Who are you trying to leave with? I need to get your name from you, okay? Hello, Tanner. My mom calling calling me. Okay. Hello. What is your name? Raven. R A V E N. You trying to leave with the girl? No, I'm finna, the girl in the coffin. I'm finna take her okay. Okay. Do you know what her first and last name and date of birth is? Yeah. Uh, uh, our money. Can you spell it? You know her birthday? Uh, 2001. I mean, 2002. Okay. okay. All right, man. If you don't mind, just chill over here for a second. I'll come back to you, all right? Okay. Yes, mom. Okay. Yes. Yeah. I ain't hurt. The girl only hit me one time, then I got back on top of her. I don't even know why she did it to herself. Like, girl, I've been wanting to fight you for the longest. Why did you do that to your friend? <sighs> She's sitting in the car with Noopy. Well, Noopy's standing outside. Noopy, I don't know what Noopy tells the police. I don't even know what point. Like, it's 7 o'clock in the morning. I'm so tired. Like, I don't know what these two share location. I don't know what these two got going on. I don't know how the girl even know where I stay at. Like, I don't even know. Yeah, it's so. It, 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 she, she going to yeah, it's all the way far away. Top one central name, date of birth. Yeah. He right here. 2000. <laughs> yeah, I'm these. I'm tired. I don't know what to do. Don't Okay. Take that man's down. You ain't got clear about your business and why y'all have trouble. 
Okay. All right. Yeah, he's talking to me. Man, the fire alarm going on. I don't let her on. Something ain't right. My fire alarm, the only alarm going on. So I walk outside and I see her talking to Snoopy. I'm like, oh, this our money. So I grabbed the weapon out the house. I don't, I don't want this to go anywhere because I'm, I'm in college for nursing and I cannot have nothing. Where are you going home. to college? I'm in college now. I just did online for this semester. Okay. And, I, and I'm doing nursing. I'm almost done. So I really do not want. Oh, good for you. My wife's a nurse. It takes a lot of work, a lot of dedication. What's your date of birth, Miss Armani? And I came down here thinking about me being in school. That, that's why I didn't ask because, like, you know, I'm better than this and I got a lot going for myself. So who started the brew ha between you and her? I mean, did she start it? Did you start it? Was it mutual or mutual? mutual? Do you have any injuries? No, because it wasn't that big for the year. That's what I'm saying. The whole investigation charge and stuff. I don't. I don't so you don't need an ambulance or anything? It's not that big for the year. Okay. The man said you put it up. I did put it up. I put it up. I ain't use the whip. I just use. My, I ain't really with all it anyway. You know I can fight, so it didn't really bother me. So yeah, but the girl hit me. Our money had our destiny to say why he at your house and then hit me. Oh, it's so with for our money. So. What did you grab from in the house? Oh, it was some scissors. I put it back though. Some scissors. I ain't used those. Go ahead. I ain't gonna lie. I put it back in the house. They on the bed. When you saw her out here, is that when you went back in the house and got them, or uh -uh, had she I, already I, hit you first? Uh, uh I ain't already had them with my hand. At what point did you grab them? Why did you grab them? Let me ask you that, I guess. I just felt, I just felt like something was going on. Did you grab them before you even came out? Yeah, that's what I said, yeah. I felt like something weird was going on, that's what I said. Okay, so before you even saw her, you actually yeah. had them. Yeah, I had my keys there and my phone. That's what I'm saying, I don't know what my keys at though. Oh, I got this. <clears throat> so, did anything happen to, between you and your boyfriend, aside from you came here looking for him and then... No, I literally went, went here looking at him. So you can ask his mom, he was on phone his mom the whole time. She heard me saying, who lives here? We just like the growth of the race this day. You're supposed to be gr grieving. Mm -hmm. Like, who, who lives here? That's all I want to know. And she kept telling me just to leave. It don't matter who stay here. That, that's kind of like, like in social my intelligence. I didn't come up here for nothing. I want to know where he was at, who he was with. That was it. Okay, all right. Have he, has he, I'm not saying that he was. I'm just asking, has he, I mean, how long y'all been together? Okay. Has he ever, like, stepped out on you before no. that you know of? See, that's not, it's, it's no part. It's just to be nothing. We always talk stuff out. That's, that's why I'm so surprised to hear. Last night, after, after doing everything, we really talked. We just had a heated discussion. Okay. So I was like, okay, you know what? I'm, I'm sick of this. So I called him at 5 o'clock this morning to talk things out. I thought I slept on him. Now I look at his location and he here. That's why I'm just so, I'm kind of calm and I'm shocked. This ain't okay. before. Do y'all live together or do you live yeah, separately? You live separately? <laughs> Where were you out here when the altercation occurred? Were you down at the bottom of the stairs? What area? Right, right there. I don't walk into Kind of over by the tree? Yeah, I walked to my car. Generally? Yeah. Where were they talking when you walked out? Did you come down these stairs? Is yeah, that where your apartment yeah, is? The stair. Yeah, my apartment literally right here. Okay. And it was mine with the only one going on, so I was trying to see. And when you came people. out and saw, you said you saw them out here when yeah, you came out? Yeah, and then out. she just hit me. Where were they? Right here. She started walking towards me. Yeah, she started here. walking towards so me. So she came towards you? Yes. Oh. Literally. No, nah, she hit me and first. You did, no, I didn't hit her. Huh? You, you did get back on top of her, you said. So she hit you. Did you yeah. fall to the ground at that point? Yeah, I fell. Did you both fall? Yeah, like, okay. yeah, she was on top of me. Okay, and then you me. got on top of her? Basically, I went for the jig, get beat up. Okay, did you, did you get a chance to hit her back or anything at that mm -hmm. point? Or did you just get on top mm -hmm. of her and, and, and what I happened told her exactly? I let go of my hair. She hit my hair. Okay. So I would just grab her hair to let go of my hair. Okay. It's it. And then, so what, she let go and you yeah, just got up? Yeah, she let go, up. and then we were looking for my phone. Yeah, we were just looking for, I noticed my phone and my key were gone. Okay. Was there any more altercation after that? No, she took my phone. She had my phone over here. She actually had it? Yeah. How did you get it back? It was sitting right here beside the, um... So she took it and then just put it down yeah. over here? Yeah, and she said she told him that she took my phone. She told the boyfriend that she took my phone. Okay. I knew that, though, because I was on the phone. <clears throat> when I was walking outside, I was on the phone with my friend. So there was no more mm -hmm. fighting after that? What, she came no. and got in the car, or what? Yeah, she just sitting in the car. I don't know why. Is that his car or hers? Yeah. That's I don't even car? know how she got here. Okay. <laughs> I don't even know how she know where I live in. <laughs> okay. Do you want to press charges against her? Depending like, yeah, on the results like, of our investigation. Yeah, he's all weak for her. All right. Yeah. Hang, hang tight right here, okay? Okay. 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 All right. Yeah. Give me a minute. I'll be right back, mister. Okay? Thank you. Okay. So Come on.
messing around with Boko. She showed up here. Wait, I don't, what? Well, I don't, don't know that. Well, don't the girl in the car pulled the fire alarm to find out what apartment he was in. So that's a charge in and of itself. Yeah, that's, yeah. Uh, that's a charge yes. in it. Yeah. Um, How do we know that, though? He told me that she pulled the alarm to find out what apartment she's in. How does he know that? Evidently, the contact somehow weird about how she even knew where he was at, but she is... Well, she was tracking him, it sounds like on a phone, yeah. Like that, and knew yeah. the building. Yeah. The alarm got pulled, and then that was it. So have you asked about the alarm at all? No, because I didn't know that part. Okay, so look, my name's Blake. I know we haven't spoke too much besides just asking you to sit in the vehicle, right? Um, so can you kind of give me a little bit of information? I haven't spoke to you again yet. I've kind of talked to one half or another. I see you got some scratches on your face. Um, looks like some fresh scratches on the right side of your face. They're swollen up too, right like by your eyelid and stuff. You see those? Okay. I, it sounds like y'all kind of were just in like a mutual fight. Is that y'all both kind of just scrapping? It wasn't even a fight. It was really like full of hair. That's why I saw like him. Mm -hmm. Like a hawk, he said, brawl or brutal. Yeah. It wasn't even that deep. That's why I just said, I'm just going to try to find her keys with you. I feel like she might have known a little something was up because she even said, I came out. I felt like something was up, so I came out with scissors. <laughs> just in case. But she says she came out. They were over here talking, these two. And she's walking this way. And she just starts going that way and comes up to her and hits her. And so then they just start rolling around on the ground. Okay. It wasn't an argument. Who, who pushed or who hit first? Did you hit her first? Don't know. You just know y'all both kind of got into it? Okay. Um, did you pull the fire alarm out here this morning to find out where he was at? No. Okay. How'd the fire alarm get pulled then? He, he could have pulled the fire alarm. Like, I'm, I'm literally up there asking him who lives here. That's it. Okay. So the whole thing, when they come out here, they the first ones to start talking. Oh, she pulled the fire alarm. She pulled the fire alarm. Like, can, can you really prove that I pulled the fire alarm? Or it could have been home. She was coming out here and knew he had left anything. Okay. How did you find out he was here? His, his location. So you just tracked him on the phone? Yeah. Okay. And I, and I, didn't, I didn't do anything. It's just like, these people, I literally asked people to leave here. We could have been left. I had 10 minutes who was here. Mm -hmm. So, even his mom was on the phone. And she trying to tell me, oh, it don't matter who lives here. Just, just leave. No, that's all I wanted. I told him. He kept telling me it don't matter. Okay. So again, back to y'all's little tussle. You don't know who hit who first, as you're, you're saying. That just both got got into it, rolled on the ground or whatever. Yeah, they're basically. Okay. Y'all ever lived together? That's why I'm just so cool. You and her. Do we live together? Have y'all ever lived together? No. Okay. Just, it's just a question we gotta determine if it's part of a family violence situation or not. Okay. Um, and now something about you were talking about keys or a phone getting tossed. Is that right? That's what I'm saying. That's I'm ready to go because I never, I don't. If I if she came out with keys, what I heard. Mm hmm. Like, she had scissors on her. I would have took scissors to keep up the family, but... Okay. Like, that's why I'm, I'm just asking y'all just looking at it as I was going to go. All and right. I really feel like she's not thoroughly looking because she wants people to stay out here. Okay, well, we will take a peek over there in a second from what you tell me. So if you find this girl keys, can we just leave? I'm not and saying that yet. we got a lot of on this. We're trying to work through it, okay? It, these things take time. See the big scratch on the right side of her face? She's saying she doesn't recall who hit who first. It just kind of was a rolling around tussle on the ground that she tracked him here on his cell phone by the app. And he was talking to her and just wanted to know who was, who was he with, basically, right? Is that right? And I, I called him before I came. I called him one time. Yeah. It just didn't come out, so I wanted to start. Because I don't know who he here with. I just assumed it was her. Okay. That's why I kept asking, because if I knew it was her, I would never ask. All right. And you're saying you didn't pull the fire alarm? No. you say it could have been her or him, is what you're saying? Yeah. Okay. All right. When did you start talking to him? Like, at what point did he come out? Hey, well, I know you were saying... Hold on, hold on, hold on. I know you were saying Armani pulled the fire alarm, right? Did you actually see her pull the fire alarm? So, like, what what floor is it going to be at? Um, yeah, I mean, no, um, I want to say... I really want to say the second. Second floor, okay. Oh, but you saw her go over there and yank on the thing and pull it down? Yeah. Okay, so I know she's telling me that obviously she tracked, tracked you here by the phone, right? Yeah. Now, you were saying originally that she pulled the fire alarm to find out where you were at or who you were with. No, she was trying to figure out who I was with. Okay, so that's why she pulled the alarm. So you were outside yeah, talking with her. Yeah, because I, 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 she kept asking me who I was up there with. Mm -hmm. and, I, and I kept telling her I won't go tell her because they wanted none of her business. Yeah. So then when she pulled the fire alarm, trying to, try to figure out who, who I was in there with. Okay. 
So you were, you were outside talking to her, and she wanted to know who was in the apartment that you were with. So she yeah. went over there and yanked the fire alarm. Yeah, and I told her, bro, we could talk about it down the road, mm -hmm. bro. Cause I already, listen, when she not understand, bro, you not at home. Yeah. You on other people's property. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. And, and, I, and I know how ass is going to I know they would lock your ass up. Mm -hmm. Doing, I'm trying to figure out this, bro. Like, oh, before you get your ass yeah. off, don't. See, that's what I was trying to avoid, though. And, and for y'all, for her to sit here and bring y'all out here, mm -hmm. and they're like, okay. Well, I would say the reason I'm asking the fire alarm, the fire alarm's an issue in and of itself. That's, I mean, it's 7 o'clock on, Oh, it's you know, also the, the fire alarm be an issue itself. It is a charge. Uh -huh. So that's why I was asking for clarity, and you're saying you, you saw her pull the fire alarm, okay? I don't know if she's going to take a ride for that right now or not, but you know, yeah, I think it ties a whole fire truck up. Sometimes, especially on these, it'll tie up five or six yeah. fire trucks. So it's a, it's a public issue right there, right? It wakes everybody up, it's a, it's an issue. The, the apartments get billed for it. Um, so we'll go from there. I know she's got a big old scratch on the side of her face. You, you said you just basically saw them rolling around, right? Yeah, they, they, was there, they weren't fighting, they were there rolling around. Yeah, cat fight like, kind yeah, of thing? Yeah, okay. Yeah. You see keys or a phone get nah, thrown? I, I, nah, I know I they keep talking about no, keys. I, they got... I haven't seen her keys. Okay. But I knew when they were rolling around on the ground, mm -hmm. and, um, I seen her phone laying, laying on the ground. Okay, lay on the so, ground over there. So, uh, I mean, she got it now, but okay. at the time when she was looking for it, I was just like, you know, your phone was there, right? Mm -hmm. Like, I, I seen it. Like, I, I literally seen laying on the ground. And then yeah. she was on the phone at the same time, so. Mm -hmm. Okay. But she, but she got it. Well, this may happen today too, man. We're pretty short-handed. If anything, you know, you're telling me you saw her pull the fire alarm. That's a witness's perspective. We may take it to a judge and see if a judge will present the warrant, sign the warrant. We may do that. We may just let y'all separate and go about our day too, all right? So we're going to figure it out. Uh -huh. That's now, I, did these I, keys, did they get thrown or what? I, don't, I didn't never I'm see her check with my house. You never even saw her with any Sir, keys. can I check my house right quick so they won't be looking? Because I, I put it in one spot in the house. Yeah, my yeah, you can keys. go ahead and go That's on right. in. Yeah. As hey, long as... Number? I don't even want her to know, really. I'll tell you later. No, on. I, I got it. I got yeah. it. Just do me a favor. I'm just going to say this blanket statement, not because I think you will, but if you go in for your keys, make sure you don't come out with any kind of weapons or anything like that, okay? Like I said, just blanket statement. Well, she thought she had them. The, the, the altercation occurred. Now she doesn't. You know, her phone got up and walked away at one point, so she's thinking maybe the same thing did with her keys. But now that's why she's asking, well, let me go in and check the house again and just make sure. I didn't leave them in there by accident. This is how clarity states come to, come to an end. You, know, you obviously don't even know who got hit first, right? You just know y'all got into it. Yeah. So same thing. When, when this kind of stuff happens, you know, people get amped up and things kind of slip through the cracks. But sometimes. see, it's not, I, I'm sorry to cut you off, but it, 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 it's not like amped up that big but deal. That's why we, we all so calm. Ain't nobody adrenaline rushing because it wasn't even a real fight. It ain't even nothing that so-called escalate. You get what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So y'all better find my key before I find my key. Because don't come to my house messing with me. Well, it was enough of something that we got a whole bunch of blue and red out here today. So, I mean, to say that it was nothing no, I, I don't isn't mean, really a fair it's statement. Not like, you, yeah, you're right. I'm not saying, I, I'm just saying, like, nothing as in, like, not a big deal, like, nothing major. Like, I'm right right like a like yeah. a, a stove for you to a house for you, you get what I'm saying? Okay. All right, well, she's going to go inside. They're looking over there, and, and we're hoping to about get things wrapped yeah, up. If you can just hang tight for just a sec, okay? No, she won't. We'll make sure. We're going to be right here. He witnessed her pull the fire alarm. Wait, so he witnessed her pull, he the, witnessed fire. Her pull yes. the fire alarm. I uh, made sure clear. I even told how him. Was, how was he already out? So he was talking to her downstairs. I guess when she was calling him or whatever, yeah. after finding out where he was at, found out he was here. He talked to her down here. The whole thing about pulling the fire alarm was she wanted to know who he was with because he wouldn't tell her. Um, he even said, let's just get in the car and leave. Clark County comes out here. They lock people up for this kind of stuff. Let's just leave. You don't need to know who she is. Uh, so he witnessed her pull the fire alarm to find out who purple shirt is. So at this point, it's not a not a massive concern. Um, I'll do the report if you want to. It's not family violence, right? No. Not family violence. No, because this it's just these two seems more of an affray at this point. Know, you know each other from high school and got into it over this yeah. guy. Then I would, me personally, with how we are, since we have three of our four West Side units today, I'm going to say split the parties 10-8. I can take the report. I'll present a warrant for her. For the. Uh, the pulling of the fire alarm to a judge 
Um, I, I was looking up over here. It's it's a misdemeanor. I can't remember exactly what it falls under, though. Sure. But I'll present a warrant to the judge about that. Explain to her she and him can get out of here. She can go about her day, and she can present warrants if she wants to. Okay. She's covered in hair and on grass and stuff too, isn't she? Yeah. Oh yeah. I wrote it down. Then, she's got dirt on her knee and elbow. Okay. She's got the little thing here under her yeah. nose piercing. And she's got a big scratch on her stress, face now. Which she told me that she never hit her never got a chance to hit her okay. but she was after she got hit and they went to the ground she said i did end up getting on top of her mm, then i'm gonna go ahead and just about push that as a free we'll do that then if you're cool with that i'm gonna I fill marty so. in I think so. god dang not really any way to get behind those bushes either is there no. not without getting mauled oh you're behind it you want the flashlight yeah. here you go Were they in there? Did you find your keys? Uh -huh. you, uh -huh. um, where you put my keys? Yes, sir. You found your keys? No. Can you ask her where she put them? Speak to her real quick, but there's no keys in the house. No keys in the house. Oh, well, check. That's right here. She need to get in the top. Because if you had my phone, I know you had my key. Because everything's right here. Here's what we're fixing to do. I don't so, know why my mom wants y'all. I don't need to speak to her. You can talk to her. And the clarity was she tracked him on the phone over here, got here. He came in and talked to her. She wanted to know who he was with because he's messing around with both girls. So she went and pulled the fire alarm to find out who the girl was he was with. So if you're fine with that, that's kind of the direction I'm going to roll so we can we can move forward and get back to service. Okay. Let me let me just ask you this straight up and, and get this out of the way because I don't know if they have asked you. Okay, so I'm going to, and I want 100% honesty and truth so that we don't have to take things any further. Do you have her keys? No, if no, so, I, please I hand them over to me it, now and nothing more will come of that. If that's the case, I would have been able to wrestle with the lead. That's why I even offered to help over there. Like, seriously, maybe if, if they did get thrown, like, if she threw them, maybe they okay. got caught in the one. So, so let me ask you this honestly, okay? Honestly, because if we're honest, nothing's going to come of it. Did you throw her keys? No, because I never had the keys. That's why I said I didn't even hear her come down with the keys. I didn't know she had keys. Okay. Unless it was a phone and Susan. Because if I'm so ready to go, if I had her keys, I would have been just gave them to her. So we can leave. Because I have no reason to have her keys. She lived here. So why would I not want her to leave home? That's me. <laughs> Well, there's many reasons people would take someone's keys. The first and most obvious is just out of spite because of a situation. If I'm being honest. Don't y'all have the little long things you use to open windows? Just, just do that between the bushes and they might fall out. If, if she had lost them over there, if they over this, is this a trash can? Well, no, they should have so. been thrown that, that far. Just... You're good with what we talked about? I am. Do you want me to explain it to her? I can come talk to her. Hey, boss man. Okay. Hey, I'll fix it and get out of here. No, but I want to find the keys because I don't want a person thinking I still have them. That's what I said before. Before we even leave, I just want her to find the keys. All right, so here's what we're going to do today, okay? We're going to let y'all separate. However, if you want to sit in the car, man, you're more than welcome to. We're fixing to let y'all leave, all right? Um, I've got somebody else out here, different area that I talked to that saw you pull the fire alarm, okay? So what we're going to do is I'm going to make a report to document the entire situation today. I am going to present a warrant to a judge about you pulling the fire alarm. So you may have a warrant at some point, okay? That's why I'm not taking you to jail right now. We'll let the judge hear it out first. So if they sign it, you'll have an active warrant for doing that. Um, however, for the time being, y'all just need to separate and go about y'all's day. You're leaving with him, right? Yeah, I just called him. Okay. That's fine. Y'all can talk about whatever y'all want to. I would highly suggest if you have an issue with him fooling around with another girl, you find a different guy. Like the first time, that's why I told him there's no, no kind of prior anything. We just buried his, his brother in the street. How'd you get here this no. morning? Because I knew it wasn't going to escalate. No. This I was like, he was going to no. take me home. Report you're saying you didn't do anything with the keys, okay? I'll notate that in the report. No luck. No. The case of the mysterious lost keys. However, I'm going to give her the option. She can always go in front of a judge and seek a warrant, okay? Same thing as you can do. I'm going to explain it to you in a second when I get the case number. If you want to go to a judge and try to present a warrant uh, for a simple battery or battery for her getting your face and stuff, you can do that as well, okay? However, since y'all don't have a family violence relationship, y'all obviously are separated. You don't live together. He is just a third party to this entire situation, just the middle man, all right? I'm going to let him take you somewhere else. You'll be away from her. I would highly suggest y'all stay away from each other. And if you think it's going to be a habitual issue, 
you can always go to the judge and talk about getting a temporary protection order and that can give you a court order about kind of contact you can have with her okay 96 central last four so miss armani did you grab her phone yeah i did so when you grabbed her phone, you didn't grab her keys. No, I think I left the well, I left the scissors and stuff on the ground. Yeah. I just took her phone. It was good. Hey, Miss Armani, can you come over here? Yeah. But she's saying her keys were right by her phone. No, Susan, the red Susan were by her phone. I never seen keys. Because think about it, if I if I gave her back her phone, I could just get her keys with I, I gave her back her phone. Okay. So you never had her keys? No, I didn't hear her come down to her keys. Can I please help y'all look? Okay. Because maybe if you shake a bush or yeah. something, they, they yeah. might fall out. This is gonna be the easiest resolution to get us all out of here, okay? We want to help the best that we can. However, we also just can't sit out here looking for hours for keys. She can always look at them, and I'll explain to her if she finds the keys to give us a call back, and we can update the report documenting that the keys were actually located. Okay, ma'am? Are you positive you can't have a key? I'm gonna want you. You want to get in the car and go, man? You, you can go. She can keep looking out here. We can maybe help her a little bit longer, but that way you get her out of here. Okay, I'm gonna give you this case card. You can get in the vehicle. I'm gonna get him to come get you, and y'all can go ahead and leave. All right? You have any questions for me, ma'am? Yes, what I'm saying. He can come get you. Okay. Yeah, he can get you. Get out of here with you. Raven, did you do you remember coming down with keys? Did she check her car? It's like a bush. Or she ain't gonna talk to you. I can go ahead. That room to back out of here, man. Yeah, you go ahead, man. Okay, I'll take it easy. Oh my gosh, like we haven't found. Mm -hmm. She's like, check a bush or something. I'm like, you guys literally just spent 10 minutes over here checking the bushes. <laughs> All right, ma'am. Here's kind of what we're going to do, okay? They're going to go ahead and get it here. Here's my information. I'm Officer Manning, badge number 2396. That's the case number. Um, from what I'm gathering today, we're just going to write it up and we'll make a report to document everything, okay? I'm getting facts that you hit her, that she hits you. I can see that you've always been rolling around the dirt and the grass. She's been rolling in the, the dirt and the grass. She's got a scratch in her eye. I can see you got a mark on your nose, okay? So if right now, I'm going to present a warrant to a judge in reference to her pulling the fire alarm. Mm -hmm. And if you want to, you can go to the courthouse with the case number I gave you and seek a warrant against her uh, for battery or simple battery if you would like, all right? Okay. Any questions for me? No. Okay, please do it. If you end up finding your keys at any point, whether they're in the same position or intact uh, items that you originally had, or if you find them damaged, you can't find them at all, Give us a call at some point in a couple of days. You can call 911 and say, hey, I need to update a case. Give them the case number. Any officer can help you and just say, look, I found my keys in my house. I found my keys in my cars. I found them in the bushes, whatever. So we can update the report to document where they were actually located, okay? okay. You have any questions for me? No. Okay. You mind giving me your apartment number now that she's gone? Okay. Thank you, ma'am. All right. You have a good day. A warrant was issued for Armani, and she was placed under arrest on February 17th, 2022. If you enjoyed this video consider subscribing and maybe like the video.